Barker, you ready? As ready as your wife is after a shot of Hennessy. This show is all second chances. Where's Trey Barker? You know, he's been incarcerated for 15 years for selling crack in his own community. Then he learned his lesson. He got a second chance, now he gonna do it right. I wouldn't even know where to begin. Look, we do it like everybody else. We start from the beginning. I play Shannon. She hooked up with Trey. She was in love with him deeply. He, you know, loves the streets more than he loved her, is how she sees it. Are you serious, Trey? Wait for me. Trey yeah. said. And then here comes Trey, fresh out of jail, coming looking for her. But she's married now. There she is. Oh, she got a roommate. No! A white dude! Ah! She never told him that she was pregnant when he went away. So now he finds out he has two kids. How did you and a Caucasian man make two kids whose last name could be Wesley and Snipes? I'm a father. Trey is coming back, being reintroduced into society and uh, has to live at this halfway house that I, you know, I'm in charge of. I bust Trey's balls. You thought she was just going to wait for you? She just got lost. Yeah, she got lost on another man's bouncy house. <laughs> My character is uh, Cousin Bobby. Um, he's not the sharpest tool in the shed, but uh, he's definitely the most fun. Isn't Jay-Z from around here? And Barbara Streisand. She from Flatbush, dumbass. I think the humor in this show comes from a real place where you have these colliding worlds. I'm watching you. I'm watching you too, Mangina. I'm not a Mangina. I'm just a regular man. For me, this show is what I've seen, is what I've observed, is what I've been through. I'm just really happy to be doing something like this, because I don't think there's anything like this on TV.